According to the National Alliance of Mental Illness, one in five adults will experience mental illness this year. And in an effort to bring awareness right here in our community during National Suicide Prevention Awareness Month, people throughout Kern County will walk to prevent suicide today. 23 ABC's Imani Stevens is live in Central Bakersfield and has more on the Stomp Out Suicide Walk. Imani? Just you have keys to your car. Good morning, Tori Emma. Today, people will come out to Beach Park to remember and honor those that were lost by suicide and bring awareness to suicide prevention. So I'm going to bring in Ellen Eggert, who is the founder of SALT, a local nonprofit. Good morning. Good morning, Imani. And what can people expect if they want to come out here today? Uh, it's not a somber event. It's a hopeful event. So we people are already starting to show up. We're going to have vendors here, and the actual walk starts at 9, Mayor Go. Uh, a representative from Senator Hurtado's and Senator Grove's office will be here. Then we're going to have the walk. It's not a competition. <laughs> it's too hot for a competition. And after that, we, we have a really great basket uh, uh, opportunity drawing, a 50-50 drawing, and a couple speakers who've lost loved ones to suicide. So it's, it's very hopeful. And you're raising donations. I know the goal for October 1st, the deadline, is $20,000. And so far, you have a little bit over 16000 What does it mean to you to have so much so close to the deadline? It means a lot because what we do with those funds, we have no administrative, no one gets paid. Everyone who is on our board or volunteers has lost a loved one to suicide. So we don't want any other family to go through this. And we... We assist people who've lost loved ones to pay for funerals, and we go to many, many health fairs, many, many events for veterans or LGBTQ, any population, and try to educate the public on suicide. We have sent uh, a couple of young ladies to a grief camp just for suicide who lost a sister. So all of these funds go in support of prevention of suicide and assisting those bereaved by suicide. So with that money, we put it to good use because we want to reduce the rate of suicide in Kern County. And today, if you don't $125, you receive a free t-shirt as well. Yep, and this, we have black and purple. Okay, and can you tell us a little bit about the quilt that we're standing in front of? This quilt, um, everybody on this quilt died by suicide, and, and this is a uh, the faces of suicide. We know that suicide doesn't discriminate. Everyone on here had a, a normal life, and the, it's a tribute in memory and honor of our loved ones, and they all... You know, they're not how they died, they're how they lived. And we want people to look at this and say, wow, they, they look normal. And they were normal people, and they were people just like you and I. Okay, thank you so much, Ellen. And again, today, the Stomp Out Suicide Walk starts at 9 a.m., but you come, the event starts at 7.30. You come down here. It's until noon at Beach Park, live in Central Bakersfield. I'm Imani Stevens, 23 ABC, connecting you.